Can Fiona get over her resentment of her youngest sibling? Watch and see. Hello, my name is Jennifer and welcome to part eight of my Rags Riches Growing Together edition. And if you are returning, welcome back. And she has sage advice on love from receiving life lesson on love, which I'm guessing is something that Eleanor did. But she's not that cute from feeling bitter about someone nearby. Surely they aren't that cute. I think my sibling is kind of weird looking, to be honest. So I'm trying to get her to interact with her because one, she needed attention and her mom only has so much attention. So maybe if she gives her the attention, uh, then perhaps her uh, mom can give her attention. Seems to be building her confidence, if nothing else. And I don't know if we can encourage her for doing that. I got a picture of her. Let me pause. Let me take a look at the options here, see if we see anything. Uh, I doubt there's anything on parenting. We can ask about Faze, because she's in a rebellious phase, of course. And I'm not going to teach her anything right now. I don't think it's the time. Uh, affection. I was trying to... Um, why don't we express love? Why don't we stop painting? I This painting is a paint from reference of uh, Fiona with her sister, which so the emphasis was more on Fiona. We'll see how it turns out. <laughs> and, um, praise, effort, and creativity growth. There you go. Let's, let's do something positive with her. Uh, she, she was okay when the sister was paying attention to her, but as soon as she stopped, it didn't actually stay there. Okay. And that that... She's still angry, not that cute. Complain about the cloudy weather. Can you, like, talk to your sister and see if that can stop her from meeting the social? Because oh, no, her mom is getting there. Of course. She's not... I don't know that she's hungry. Um... Hmm. I don't think we have anything really to sell. I mean, I guess we could just come sell these. Why don't you just come do this? Actually, before you do that, why don't you rally the troops with Eleanor? Your mom needs help too, I saw. The bladder's getting low and her hunger. <laughs> so why don't we rally the troops a couple of times? Is this needing cleaning? Nope. But we can scatter some food. And why don't we get a chicken nugget of advice and name the rooster, name the hen, and don't we have another chicken? Oh, the chicken is there. <laughs> They're still in the house. Only one is in the house, but one is all it takes. Okay. All right. So is there anything else we can do? Uh, check in on Fiona. He, I did have the option to, uh, maybe, I was able to soothe them to sleep, and I thought I had on the playpen before, but I think maybe the issue was because Eleanor had put him there, and so then because she, I'm just speculating, I don't know, <laughs> I really don't know, but, okay, well, she's busy now, she's still angry, I just want to take a look, where did she go, there she is. Is the chicken leaving the house? Oh, but the chicken's leaving the house, and this is not. This gate is locked, so the chicken can't get in there. So if I lock the door, the chicken's locked out. I have to go into build mode and just pick the chicken up and put it in there and then lock the door. Um, so let's just take a look at... Uh, I'm going to take a quick look and see if I can find anything. Well, I see this teach about plants, which I don't actually remember being there before. Anyways, that's not what I was looking for. Yeah, I, I don't see anything specifically... Because it shouldn't be under parenting. So it just randomly came up at that one point. That one that we saw before. But uh, but she also doesn't have a negative sentiment with her. She just has a negative sentiment about, you know. If you get in there. Can you get in there? You probably can't. Seriously. You can't walk there either. <laughs> it's not walkable. What you going to do? Uh, whatever I told you to do before. It'd be nice if you could get around. The food is over there. Maybe you'll come over there? It's kind of a long way around. 
the other two chickens are there. You know what? I'm gonna help you along, because it's a long way. So, over there you go. And lock the door, um, all chickens. <laughs> Let's keep those chickens out of the house. <laughs> now that they're here. And walk through the walls. Hopefully they won't. And... Let's try a family kiss. Let's try and do some interacting. Not with the plants. Seriously. Like, let's do some... I don't know what we have to do. Oh, right, I gotta add the presents. Because that's the one that I don't put on until later. What do I have here? I do have decorate. And open presents. An art and music spirit egg hunt. Which we need to do. And... Um, why don't we read to her? Why don't we... I'll hunt for an egg. <laughs> and then open... And we won't read a toddler book. We'll actually read a children's book to her. Because, you know what? Why don't we put her on to this? So any socializing is at least going to count. And we're hopefully get a bit of time to interact. I think we need to call it. Oh, do we have free services? I don't think we do. I think we need to get free services if we have the points. We do. And we're going to call a nanny. <laughs> it was okay when we just had an infant. Now we have a newborn too. <laughs> and we have a child who seems to need some attention. So getting a nanny is only going to be helpful. So let's go in here and hire a service and we get a scheduled gardening service, though it's too late because it's Friday and with a maid isn't going to help. Hire a service, hire a nanny. We could get a butler, but then we need a bed for the butler. Okay, come over here and baby care. Let's try this help with needs again. Get rid of all of these stupid crying baby ones and just do the help with needs. Are you angry again about the crying baby? <laughs> you are confidence boost from having your efforts praised. I believe in me. Does that, did that even do anything? Oh, it did. It was just slightly delayed response. Okay, my na name is, okay, hopefully Nanny, you have um, good traits. So, deep thoughts, deep conversation, and uh, interests, discuss interests, and friendly hobbies, no, Small talk. That's the one that it is. I should be get to know. Get to know. And... Friendly. Small talk. Ask about career. What do you want, Lavinia? Sorry to call you out of blue, but I had a dream about you last night. We were in a field and there were these electric llamas and they were sleeping. I'm not sure whether they're electric, but you wouldn't, give me, you wouldn't let me wake the llama. Why wouldn't you let me wake the llama, Madison? Why? I'll just be nice, even though you don't have time. <laughs> just... Did we get his traits? Okay, you know what? He's, she needs... No. Why don't you... Uh... Maybe the nanny's gonna come. <sighs> Why don't we come here and encourage? Spice Festival. Uh, if we go to Spice Festival, we'll just go on our own. If we can. Oh, look, he's hungry. Okay. You know what? Why don't you come here and uh, kiss goodnight, and hopefully that'll wake him up, because I really want to feed him. Is she a hysterical again? She's very playful. Okay. No, I don't want you to. I just want you to wake up. I guess we'll have to wake you up. Uh, wake up. <laughs> I know he doesn't like waking up, so I didn't really want to wake him up, but he's also really hungry and I don't want him... Oh, she's hysterical again. Thank goodness I just have that. I'm not even going to worry about it. 
Oh, good. She's very playful. Good. So, there we go. All right. So she's still very playful. He is um okay. He's doing pretty well. And I think we're going to head over to the Spice Festival and uh, see if we can um, maybe learn a recipe and just see how it goes with an infant. But of course, we'll leave our Nibu here. So I'll be back. So we're at the Spice Festival and I have to get Avery back from um, Margaret. Eleanor, sorry, Eleanor, because we couldn't. Uh, I wanted to put him in the back carrier, and I couldn't just take him from her. I couldn't figure out how to do that. I'm not saying uh, I'm saying I couldn't, but I should really say is I couldn't. I didn't know how. <laughs> and he's crying. Cry. Okay. Just finish your food, and it's spicy. Okay. So why don't you let me check his needs? He's just tired, really, mainly. You know, we don't have a high chair here. So we're just gonna, um, I thought I saw the option to give him a nap. <laughs> it was there, just not at the top level. And since we're here, why don't we harvest whatever we can harvest? It's, uh, there's some tomatoes. I think we pretty much have, or probably have most of, if not everything that's here that we can get at this time of year. So she had had a want to order something so i had them both order something for her are you giving him the nap i thought i asked her to give him a nap oh he doesn't seem to be napping you gotta go sit down somewhere where he can have a nap he's getting a little hungry i just want you to give him a nap his energy goes down so fast oh, finally he found somewhere and he's going to sleep good oh look how cute they do sometimes nap in the back carrier, but he just was so fussy. I didn't want to have to have him cry himself to sleep. And then once he has his nap, we can feed him. And you come sit here. I, I'm guessing you can... Did you... I think I already had you do everything for the holiday. I had them open presents. I don't think they got anything special. And he's awake already. Oh, and she's feeding him. Okay. So why don't you be thankful? And ask if the moon is an egg. Well, your mom should be able to talk to you. Did she just throw up there? Oh, you're back. Yeah, and she did it again. Uh, talk about sibling. He's still really tired. I don't know what happened there. <laughs> I think... Warmed heart... Odd by popularity, well cared for. Okay, well, I think we probably need to take them back home so I can actually get them down for a nap. We've been here. Uh, there is probably no point buying any ingredients because we don't have really any way of cooking anything yet. But we did manage to harvest what was here, even though it probably wasn't anything special. And I don't know what, like I said, in one of my saves, I, like I said, it was a park. This still isn't a park. So we still haven't managed to get to a park. <laughs> I don't know if it'll be easier or harder once Veronica's an infant, and we haven't been able to work with Avery at all the last, you know, since our infant, our newborn was born, was, yeah, so, anyways, I am gonna take them back home, and we'll see what happens when we get there. So we're home, I have had Fiona start a yard sale, oh, both Avery and Veronica were sleeping, but Veronica's awake, Good, we sold something. We'll put that up there. Hopefully we can sell that too. Because we need a little bit more money. And I've had... Madison essentially working on our cooking skill. By I ordered some groceries since we had free services. Uh, I just put everything in the fridge just so that we had some groceries so that we could cook. Uh, I don't know if we could cook together with just Eleanor and get more food oh she got from one to six in one meal <laughs> always good so she's gonna make a blt and hopefully 
It actually works for once. Oh, she it didn't work. She came to do the cooking, even though she's not. I didn't include her. I find that happens with clubs. Okay, start. Oh, well, the holiday ended. That's what happened. I, I just saw that that went from, you know, it was three and now it's only four. There's another thing. And we have three more things to sell. Oh, good. We're making some money. <laughs> good. It would be nice to get a little bit more money. Though we have some seed packets in our inventory. Uh, I think I'm going to say yes, but I'll probably... I was going to say yes and then move her out because, of course, I need room for their daughter, their, her daughter to move in. If there wasn't an issue with possibly milestones resetting, I would say yes. I'm a little concerned that that could be the case. And we already have two, four, five, I guess. Uh, we're going to take a chance. But she's just going to come in by herself. She'll lose. I don't know who... <laughs> what relationship she has to them. I've never looked. Yeah, whatever. Okay. So you're going to come here and tend this table. And then maybe she can actually help a little bit. And learn some cooking skill. Because now that you're going to be here. Uh, we're not going to do chief of mischief. <laughs> no. That's not, not going to happen. Um, why don't you go cloud gaze? You know what? Why don't we just have her be the one who gets the points? I don't really care. Because I'm not planning on keeping her for long. Forever. I suppose she can stay until her daughter moves in and then they can switch. Not switch in terms of exactly where they are, but and we'll have her make another meal. Oh. You know what? Oh, you gonna, what are you doing? I don't know that she was hungry. She needs a diaper change. Change that dirty diaper. Please. And the sale is over. We're going to end it. Because we have nothing left to sell. So now that we've sold that, we have Eleanor living with us. We kind of need to get her a bed. Even if she doesn't sleep. So what I'm going to do is I am going to buy another bed like this. Or maybe just a sleeping bag. And put it upstairs just in case she wants to sleep in it. And get a violin for our little Fiona. So I'll do that quickly. And you know what? Why don't we sell this stuff? And we'll have a lot of money. And this was a gift. I guess we could put that there. And uh, we'll keep that for now. Chair that's broken. Can, does this fit? Okay, that fits there. That works because of what it is. The rest of the stuff is not very useful. The thing with this is it's probably scratched or something. I mean, it looks okay. It doesn't really look that bad. I think that came in the dumpster. Buy another chair. This can actually go here. And that can get moved over there. Buy that violin. And get another sleeping bag. Which we will stick upstairs. And can we change color for her? You know what? Maybe we won't stick it up. I'll leave it here. We're gonna need another crib or something. But we'll just stick with that for now. And okay. So now that you have your instrument. You can come here, and we'll put it in here, so no one's there, and you can come practice your instrument and do something productive. And you change that diaper. Good. All right. So now that we do have someone in the house, why don't you come over here and resume that painting? I was going to have you do some more cooking. Actually, I thought I asked you to... Maybe I asked her to sunbathe or stargaze, was what it was in the rain, of course. But... Then I think our um, new boo started crying. So we could age up at any point, but <laughs> I'm concerned it's going to be even more work. <laughs> Maybe once she ages up. Yeah, she can like gardening. And she got to level eight. Oh, we have a crying new boo. 
or infant, I should say, who looks like he's dirty. And he's sad because he's fussing. He's a bit hungry. Okay, stop painting. You're going to come here and change Avery's diaper. And then you're going to feed him. I do wish that when you choose the feeding preference for breastfeeding that, you know, the top level for the mom should be breastfeed. It shouldn't come up with bottle feed. And the bottle feed's a nuisance because you got all these bottles sitting around. <laughs> That's painful. All right, so what are you doing? Why don't you come help us and die for deals? Yeah? That would be good. <laughs> you give me a house? Why don't we do something productive? So you're changing his diaper. He's still sad. He's still fussing. And now he's not sad, but he's still sad. Awake and sad from waking up. And is anyone here? Ah, oh, well, we're here. I just didn't see. <laughs> she needed help. And... Okay. And if she could also do the harvesting, that would be good. <laughs> Eleanor, I mean. Okay. So we have that done. Why don't you put... Why don't you come here and do some practice standing since that's at the top level. And then why don't you... You're, you've done that, but why don't you come here and rally the troops. And we're going to adopt as a caregiver. That's not the same as fully adopting, but it is still a thing. I mean, she can like discipline her and stuff. Okay, so we did that. How are your needs now? They're fine. So let's try crawling. Let's try and get you through some of your... Now, breastfeed's on the top. He's not hungry anymore. Friendly activities, practice crawling. Let's try that. And uh, see if we can get him to crawl. Oh, is the cat sick? Yeah, the cat's probably sick. Oh, Eleanor went to work. Okay. <laughs> well, she won't be at work long. And we're probably going to take the cat to the vet. I don't know how long it takes. I know when I've tried this practice crawling, it seems to take forever to get them to crawl. <laughs> and we need a stove before we can age them up. Learn to crawl. But he also doesn't have the uh, fine finger, the pince, pince, does he? Toy mouth? I don't know that we can, can we feed him? Let's see. I'm not going to do it. No, let's just help him explore food. So he can't do the finger foods yet. So he hasn't got to that stage. So, but we have a new housemate. <laughs> I wouldn't say roommate because she's living with us for now. So we're actually going to leave this part here. Likes and comments are always appreciated and they really help with the algorithms. Thanks very much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!